to keep you updated, Listín Diario, the newspaper for the Dominicans, presents the most important news of the day. Wednesday, April 13th of 2022nd. The DGC returned to Listín Diario the camera and cell phone after having deleted videos and photographs of the cell phone that was used to film the outrage that the ombudsman and several reporters were subjected to last Monday at the Canodromo. The Vinicio Calventi Hospital has passed through the hands of different directors, but with only a month as a director, Jose Alfaro has remained at the foot of the fight against the, against what he considers sabotage, against the reorganization of the processes of the public health center. During the first two months of this year, the hospitals of the Public Health Network attended 324,533 emergencies, of which 295,486 patients reached the services by their own means, which represents 91.05% of the total attended. Although sunlight is essential for life, excessive exposure to the sun without proper protection can cause damage to the skin that manifests itself immediately or in the long term. The president of the National Association of Private Clinics denied that these establishments only have interest for people who have money and demanded that the National Security Council comply with the mandate that mandates the indexing of centers according to inflation rates. Avoiding tragedy due to the ingestion of alcohol adulterated with methanol and other substances should be a priority for consumers of different types of alcoholic beverage this Easter. Making use of preventive mechanisms such as verifying the security seal of the bottle caps and acquiring them in safe places of sale. From 6 in the morning, there are dozens of citizens in the Greyhound track with the same situation that, according to the complaints, happens every year when the Holy Week approach. This is a business. Since Holy Week arrives, they want to remove all the engines looking for someone to give them 500 pesos, say Adalberto Mejia with an exalted tone. The Constitutional Court declared Article 148 of Law 76-02 in accordance with the Constitution, which sets the maximum time that a criminal proceeding should last at four years, counting from the first act of the proceeding. Between 2019 and 2021, Dominican banking financing for the tourism sector had an accumulated growth of 48.9%, registering a balance of 85,087 million pesos at the end of that period, reported the as Association of Multiple Banks of the Dominican Republic. For this and more information, you can visit listindiario.com for Listing Diario. Voiceover and translations by Indira Rodriguez. To keep you updated, Listing Diario, the newspaper for the Dominicans, presented the most important news of the day.